Hi guys and welcome. And what's the most important thing when you change a phone? And you will think to get a nice case to, to choose the right model. Yes, this you are absolutely right. You are correct. But that's when you decide which phone you want to buy, which one you want to use as a new phone. Then it's very important to choose which phone, which model, how big memory do you need. And then when you need, know which model you will buy, you need to choose the case for it. That is very important. But after you will go home with your new phone, with a case and everything, you will need to migrate your data, copy your data from old phone to a new phone. And before it was a really harsh time because you had to install again from a Google Play Store each app. Some apps you have to install from an APK file, they are not available in Google Play Store. You need to install it, you need to update integrated uh, software, integrated apps from a Google Play Store, from a Samsung shop. You will need to install everything and then you need to make configuration of this in the phone settings Android settings and in each app settings. And it takes a lot of time. It can take between six and, and even ten hours to, to make complete configuration of your Android phone. And that's especially, especially complicated when you uh, change from a uh, one brand from one company to another, from Sony to uh, Samsung, from uh, Xiaomi to Realme, from Realme to Oppo. It's complicated because each lay layout of a skin on an Android is totally different. But now, uh, thank you for a Samsung uh, smart, uh, smart switch. With Samsung smart switch, it's totally different and it takes a lot of less time. Because you can copy all your data from an old phone to a new phone. And Samsung smart switch works when a, your destination phone is Samsung Galaxy S series, Z series, or A series. And the source phone can be any phone with Android or iOS. Then you'll be able to copy mostly, mostly all your data. Not everything, because some app you will need to activate and um, log in again. But most apps will be copied with all settings and data. And that's great. You can use two. There are two ways to make it. First, you can use a table. In a modern phone, you will need USB Type C to Type C, C to C cable, or if you copy from a from a iOS, you need a cable Lightning to USB Type C. You can also make the copy using wireless. You only need to remember that both both phones needs needs to be connected to the same Wi-Fi network. So you will need to connect to the same Wi-Fi network old phone and a new phone and then they will discover each other and then you will be able to copy all data. You will need to, to put your password on an old phone and authorize that you want to send the data to a new phone and it will take some time, less or more. If you connect by a cable, you need to be know that all phones need to be charged at at least 30% more better especially the best where battery is full if, if you want to use wireless for that it's much better because you can uh, connect a power supply and your charger to an old phone and the power charger to a new phone and charge battery so will be now you know that all data will be called will be copied and there will be no problem with lack of energy you can take from a a few minutes up to even a few hours to copy all but the best thing is that when you wait for that you just need to wait for that until it will be copied successfully all settings will be migrated even the ringtones everything in the android settings uh, app settings will be migrated even wallpaper and a place on a screen where there is an icon for each app everything will be migrated from just one to one like a carbon copy you only need to remember that there are a few apps which uh, are you will need to activate again. Are, this is a banking apps, these are banking apps and social media apps. So banking, Google Wallet, 
and Facebook, Insta, social media, WhatsApp. You need to activate again all other apps like fast food apps, travel apps. They will be copied and with everything. It saves your time. From my point of view, it saves up to 80% of your time if you copy from one phone to another. And of course, many other brands also make the, some type of software to copy data. You can migrate, migrate your data to a Chinese brand phone like Xiaomi, Realme, Oppo. You can copy your data from Android to iPhone and from other many others. But uh, my preferred is Samsung uh, Smart Switch, so we can copy from an old phone to a Samsung Galaxy phone. All data you will just need to activate a few apps, and everything works perfectly. Um, I've tried it first time when I wanted to copy uh, data from a Samsung S7 Edge to Samsung S8 Plus. S8 was the first phone made by Samsung with USB Type-C and the S7 Edge was the last phone from the S series with micro USB. So from with the old phone I had a cable USB Type-A to micro, with a new phone I had cable USB Type-A to, to Type-C and it was a small problem to copy it. But I've taken USB on the go and which convert USB Type-C slave to USB type A master, then I've used the old table A to micro and I was able to copy all data. It was the first time when I used it, it was in, in 2017, uh, almost, it was seven years ago, but now I've used it to copy data from S23 Ultra to S24 Ultra and it worked perfectly, everything was copied with a table USB type C to type C. Everything was copied, uh, everything worked, uh, Wi-Fi passwords, all settings. I just only need to make a new credential, new pin on a new phone and start my fingers again. Uh, and everything was, was copied and it took uh, about half an hour, 30 minutes to copy data and about 10 minutes for just management of all settings. So everything was perfectly with Samsung Smart Switch, so it makes it much easier to migrate data to your new phone and now uh, changing phone is not a nightmare like before. Before it was a nightmare to change uh, a phone from an older to a new one because you had to install everything and make all settings manually. Now everything is done on an automatic process on the Samsung Smart Switch. So, you don't need to do anything, you just need to install the, that app serves with message on an old phone, connect to phones by a table, and everything will be done without your concern. So you don't have to think about anything, you don't have to do anything, just enter, enter, and everything goes straight. So and this is a reason that people will not be afraid of changing phones, just they know that everything will be moved and they will be happy with a new hardware. Thanks for watching guys and I'll catch you later.